If you are publishing exclusively on Kindle Direct Publishing's platform, you can create an account for yourself and you will get this home page with your bookshelf reports, community, and marketing. And below it, you have create a new title for ebook or paperback. We're going to select paperback. And we will get from paperback details. We want to get to the paperback content section, which includes the cover creator but we first need to add in a few details before we can do that. So we're going to go ahead and get a book title in. We'll have to have an author name. Let's get that in there. We need a description. And we own the copyright. We'll skip keywords, categories. We do need to choose a category to move forward. So we'll click one real quick, answer that question, and then save and continue. You can come back to all of this and change it later when you're ready to actually publish. All right, so we're in the content section now. We have ISBNs, print options for the interior of your book, but we want to get to book cover section. Now you can upload a cover here if you do have one already designed, but we're going to launch the cover creator and I'll show you quickly what that looks like so you have an idea if it is something that you would like to use. All right, it first starts out with letting you select images either from their gallery, choosing from your computer, or skipping that step. I'm going to choose one from my computer, and we'll add that in there. And while it's uploading, it will give you a whole range of different templates that you can choose from. So it gives you some variety, and then you can customize them how you would like. Okay, so you can see all the different options. It is giving you different colors and styles, and we have a few extra over here as well. I think I am going to stick with this one right here. And you can see it gives you the guidelines all around the edge. If you want to remove those, you can do that right here. We'll keep them on for now. I'm going to switch my title to be impact and I'm going to change the font here to a more of a sci-fi font and I'm going to do the same thing with my author name okay so that's good to go right there now I do like how the spine already looks I'm not going to change anything about that they give you a placeholder here for an author picture if you have that I'm going to grab one real quickly so that has been added and there is the author biography section here and your book description section here. The barcode area is already designated because they will provide that barcode for you. And it's really that simple to do the cover creator here. It doesn't give you a lot of creative freedom, but if you want to do something very simple and need to get something out there, you can, you can have this as an option. You can preview it here at the bottom and save when you are finished. If you head back to your main page after uploading your manuscript and ISBN and other elements, you will see down in your list of books a thumbnail example of what your cover will look like. I'm really pleased with that. That's pretty simple, but I really like how that turned out. So you can get good simple covers from the cover creator. It just doesn't give you as much creative freedom as other design softwares would, or obviously the professional look that a professional designer can give you, but it works if that is what you need to use. If you liked this video and are interested in a complete guide to learn all the steps to create your book and self-publish it, check out my Notebook to Real Book online course. Link in the description below along with some other free resources.